Hey, Isaac Hyman, High Flyer Digital here. Hope you're doing well and enjoying the day. We were so excited to jump into our C4 playbook, which is our topic for the month that we're sharing with all the brands, C4, um, that we totally blanked out on asking, how was Q1, right? Everyone's looking to jump into the next great thing, the next strategy, the next uh, solution, the next technology, shiny object syndrome. We're no different. So we actually have just started completing all our QBRs, which is the quarterly business review, where we look at the performance of Q1 in general. So my question to you is, have you started a QBR for, your, for Q1 and how you doing, right? You always wanna revisit what worked in the past and figure out how you could strengthen and go from there for the next quarter for the entire year. And Q1 sets the tone for your pace. And so it's so important to go back, revisit what worked, uh, try and examine what didn't work and improve on it for the next quarter. That's that's a great win for any business to keep organized and always moderate what trends they see at the very beginning instead of waiting for Q4 to start adapting to some problems. So. Number one, go back, revisit your Q1, make sure you do a QBR, ask all the questions, how your email perform, how your emails performed, which campaigns were great, which automations really took off, which ones you could develop and still need to test and refine, which ones aren't working well and need to be shut down, and how's your list hygiene, how's that list growing, where are they coming from, how's your uh, acquisition cost doing? All these things would all be included in a QBR. So I invite you to go back now, do a QBR, set, set that ready to go, and then you'll be better prepared for Q2 and Q3 and Q4 from here on. Talk soon, hope that was helpful.